Here is a guide to the Spooks Town Soiree Farm. It has a Halloween theme. There is the usual mix of land and water tiles to unlock. Now to take a closer look at the starting sections. As usual we have treasures to open. These require pumpkin hammers and pumpkin barrels to clear. The recipe building is called the Spooky Workshop. And the self-contained crafting building is called the Pumpkin Farm Stable. The starting water section is a bit further away this time and at the very top of the farm. However it is still next to the rest of the water tiles. You can fit the usual maximum of 45 plots on this section. To the left is the main buildable. It is called the pumpkin towerret and has the usual nine levels. To build it you will need a total of 111 pumpkin chopper, 111 wood cube and 202 hemp rope. Further to the left is the unwithering building. It is called the Halloween barn. You will need a total of 974 spooky tokens to unwrap the 30 gifts. Between these two buildings you can access the farm's main feature. It is called Pumpkin Party. Now look at the land and how it unlocks. Starting with the water tiles. Halloween Lake opens in 21 days, requires a level 1 pumpkin towerette. Opening 5 presents in the Halloween Bon and Farm Level 24. Ghostly Waters opens in 42 days, requires a Level 5 Pumpkin Towerette. Opening 20 presents in the Halloween Bon and Farm Level 51. The rest of the water tiles cost farm cash. Lake of Fear costs 59 farm cash. Daunting Pond costs 59 farm cash. Pumpkin River costs 69 farm cash. And Spider Lake costs 69 farm cash. The farm cash prices are much lower than usual. As you will see again with the land tiles. These are again on two levels. The earnable ones are next to the starting land section. Chili Quarter opens in 28 days, requires a level 3 pumpkin towerette, 
Opening 10 presents in the Halloween Barn and Farm Level 33. Pumpkin Patch opens in 14 days and requires Farm Level 15. Soiree Square opens in 35 days, requires a Level 4 Pumpkin Towerette. Opening 15 presents in the Halloween Barn and Farm Level 42. Spooky Central opens in 49 days, requires a level 7 pumpkin towerette, opening 25 presents in the Halloween Barn and Farm level 60. Parade Glen opens in 70 days and requires farm level 87. Pumpkin Pasture opens in 56 days, requires a level 9 pumpkin towerette. Opening 30 presents in the Halloween Barn and Farm Level 69. And Freaky Grounds opens in 63 days and requires Farm Level 78. The land tile surrounding these cost farm cash. Creepy Corner costs 69 farm cash. Chilling Pasture costs 69 farm cash. Middling Plains costs 69 farm cash. Pumpkin Approach costs 69 farm cash. Halloween Land costs 59 farm cash. Witch's Meadow costs 59 farm cash and Fall Blade costs 59 farm cash. The final four tiles on this section form a land bundle. It is called Haunted Hollows and consists of the following tiles. Halloween's Edge Pumpkin Playgrounds Spooky Meadow and Carnival Hollows The upper land section has nine tiles Four cost farm cash Candy Square costs 85 farm cash. Mayor's Garden costs 69 farm cash. Swampy Meadow costs 85 farm cash. And Town Hall Approach costs 69 farm cash. The remaining land is earnable by playing Farmville 2 Tropic Escape again. For Valley View Corner you need to earn 50 escape tokens. For Haunted Acres you need to earn 100 escape tokens. For Pumpkin Square you need to earn 200 escape tokens. For Town Hall Entrance you need to earn 300 Escape Tokens. And for Lake View Edge you need to earn 400 Escape Tokens. Remember playing Farmville 2 is optional you do not have to.